This is the most easiest difficult integral in MIT integral P ever. We have this problem. Integral from 0 to 1, uh, product notation k equals to 0 to infinity and 1 by 1 plus x to the, x to the power 2 to the power k dx. Uh, first of all, uh, let us try to see how this uh, product series goes and that can give us some ideas on how we can act. Uh, firstly, when x uh, when k equals to 0, we have 1 plus x to the power 1 since x to the power 0 is 1 and when k equals to 1, we have 1 by 1 plus x square and then when k equals to 2, we have 1 by 1 plus x to the power 4 and then when k equals to 3, we have 1 by 1 plus x to the power 8 and so on the series goes on okay. now now to find the product of all the series uh, we can rely upon the fact that uh, the sum the same kind of series uh, that we have here it's kind of telescoping this kind of telescoping product and uh, how we can act upon this is this kind of telescoping product if we just uh, see that uh, we multiply uh, by 1 minus x by 1 minus x yeah now you might be able to see how it's telescoping <coughs> yeah. okay now in the series we can see that uh, 1 minus x and 1 plus x will be 1 minus x square. Yeah. Then again, 1 minus x square and 1 plus x square will be 1 minus x to the power 4. And 1 minus x to the power 4 and 1 plus x to the power 4 will be 1 minus x to the power 8. And 1 minus x to the power 8 and 1 plus x to the power 8 will be 1 minus x to the power 16. And so on it goes till infinity. Yeah. Do you see? Uh, it goes uh, till infinity uh, in the same way. So, a 1 minus x and then we will have 1 minus x to the power infinity dx. Yeah. Now, since x, uh, the value of x is between 0 and 1, yes, x1 from 0 to 1. So, of course, for any such values from 0 to 1, x to the power infinity will be 0. Okay. So this value over here will be 0 and 1 minus x times 1 by 1 minus 0 dx. Okay, so this will be 0 to 1, 1 minus x dx. Now it's really easy, I guess you can do it mm, on your head as well. <laughs> so just for fun, we can use. Uh, uh, King's rule over here. So King's rule says uh, net zero a to b f of x dx uh, will be integral from a to b f of a plus b minus x dx. Yeah. So if I use King's rule, uh, it will be further simplified. It's zero to one, one minus we have one minus x over here. Okay, so that will be just 0 to 1 x dx. Now x dx we all know it. It's x square by 2 from 0 to 1. So that's just 1 by 2. And 1 by 2 is the answer. Note that uh, this uh, long infinite product series was just 1 minus x. And uh, from here we, we could have also done it. But uh, I further simplified it. And yeah, this became the most easiest integral ever because integral from 0 to 1 x dx is the first integral that we know. Okay, so this was it. Uh, thanks for watching and do subscribe us for further more videos on MH integrals and other calculus stuffs and max stuffs. Thanks for watching.